Yeah, so I have to say, Cheo, you're looking pretty good right now, and you're sporting some really fancy gear. So, Mike, can you walk us through what uh, what he's wearing here? Sure. Um, start off with the, the cuff display here. This allows the, the test subject to be able to see where he's at with maps that come up on, on his display. Allows him to look at procedures and, and drawings if need be. He has timers on there, and he can also, what's really neat about this is he can also record video and audio while he's out looking at interesting geology on the surface of some planet. Okay, and what about his headset? So headset, this was made so that we could use it with custom molded earplugs. And so each of those plugs are, are specifically made for each astronaut or each test subject. It allows the astronaut to hear without any external extraneous noises. You know, Mike, I heard that we are streaming live on Ustream every day from the field. How are we doing that? Yes, we have a, a camera right up here. This is a web camera and it, and it records high definition video. So that's what you're seeing. It, it points in the direction that the, the astronaut's walking and shows you what he's doing. How does this piece of equipment fit into the, the rover? Okay, well, we have a uh, computer in the rover that's specifically for interfacing to the backpacks. There's two backpacks per rover. Um, while they're out on EVA, the data gets sent um, over the air to, the, to the, that computer and then displays down on the ground so that the, the operators know exactly what they're doing up on the surface of the planet or wherever they may be. Um, when they get close and they want to e ingress into the vehicle, which means get into the vehicle, um, they can take this umbilical here and plug it into the SEV and all the data that's on there, regardless of whether it was sent down or not at that point, gets um, put back onto that computer, that the one that we've been talking to. So Interesting. And what about on the very back of the backpack? What okay. is this? So this is the heart of our system here. Um, inside of here we have a radio and you see the, the three antennas here are for that radio for, for communications. Um, we also have a GPS receiver. Um, this is a GPS receiver antenna and that allows us to pinpoint exactly where we're at. Um, then we have a small box called a single board computer um, which is similar to a computer at your desk, um, but it's a lot smaller and more mobile and less power. Um, so that, all those working together allow us to do all these procedure displays and, and all that kind of thing that I was describing. Very good. Well, how is the hardware working so far? It's working real good. Um, we've learned a lot and the point of doing these exercises is to learn what works and what doesn't. So we've been taking notes and, and we'll take, when we go back, we'll try to make things better and try to use our lessons learned. And is this the kind of backpack that we're going to use in future spacesuit designs? Um, functionally, it'll be the same, except that we'll have to repackage it with electronics that won't break in space in the space environment. And also, the, the mechanical structure will look different as well. So. Very cool. Well, thank you guys, and I hope everything goes well with the rest of the test. All right. Thank you very much.